Aquatics Nation. My name is Ryan Jones. I am front of house engineer and drum tech for the band Galactic. And this is Stan Moore's drum kit. Stan's kit is 100% Audix microphones. Hey, I'm Stan Moore, drummer with Galactic, and we're on the road passing through Portland, Oregon today. And we've been using Audix mics for a while, so we're out here using the mics on a nightly basis. And I've got all Audix on my drums, and we've been using them for a while because they produce a very punchy sound that is able to work in a lot of different rooms that we play in. Sometimes we play in rooms that are pretty boomy and, and we need to have the control over the tone so that we can still make the drums punchy and, and controlled in big rooms or in smaller rooms. So the Audix have been very successful for us in producing that and, and giving us what we need in all the different rooms that we play over the last 15 years that we've been touring. So if you haven't checked out Audix mics, especially on drums yet, I would definitely suggest checking them out. Stan has two kicks, one's a 26 inch, one's a 20. I've got a D6, miking the beater side. I had a lot of problems with uh, putting a hole in the head. Um, came around to the beater side and um, you're picking up a lot more attack that way. You take a look. And inside the 20, I've got a D6 mounted right in about the center of the drum. It's pretty much a bungee suspension system where it sits right dead center. It's there every day. That's how I left it, so that's a great thing. The D6 is probably the industry front runner as far as bass drum mics. So if you haven't checked out the D6 yet, I would definitely recommend checking that out along with all the rest of the Audix mics that are available for drums. Snare, we got a i5 on the top and bottom, both mounted, eliminating mic stands. Bottom mic right there. Snare 2. 10 inch, just a little popcorn snare. Um, D4 on that, and right here's the Pandero, and I mic it right underneath with the D4. I get it nice and close. So you can tell it's a low tuned drum. The Pandero is a Brazilian hand drum that I hit with a stick, and it's got a double ply head on it. We mic it from underneath, and it sounds like a floor tom with jingles. I've got ADX-51 on the hat and also the rod, both on a device clamp. On the toms, I've got Micro D's. Stanton plays a 12, a 14, and a 16. Micro D's, we're using them on toms, and they're great because they don't get in the way, and they provide us a nice, consistent, punchy, Tom sound on a nightly basis. For the overheads, I have uh, Audix CX 112. And for Sam's vocal, he's been using a OM6. Also with Galactic, I'm using a D6 on the bass mic. Uh, percussion is also all Audix. I've got i5, Portobales. Micro D's for congas and D4 for the bongos. I've also got some Audix over in my key world. I'm using fireballs on my Leslie left right. All vocal mics are OM6s uh, and our wireless package is the RAD360 with OM6 caps.